Hey, welcome everybody. Thanks for taking a moment and checking this out. Uh, we've been meeting now for a couple of weeks and gosh, I've really enjoyed uh, seeing faces and reconnecting and uh, being able to dialogue. And thank you so much for those who have been uh, able to join with us, those who have uh, continued watching online and communicating and posting there. We so appreciate your participation at, at every turn. You know, in our, in our culture and in our uh, community, uh, we've been hearing talk about uh, a spike in the coronavirus cases. And so I've been praying and asking God, what, how do we respond to that? How do we, how do we um, uh, try to navigate through that? And, and really, I keep coming back to the same mindset. And really, it's captured here in Philippians chapter 2. It says, Therefore, if you have any encouragement from being united with Christ, if any comfort from his love, if any common sharing in the spirit, if any tenderness and compassion, then make my joy complete by being like-minded, having the same love, being one in spirit and of one mind. Do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit. Rather, in humility, value others above yourselves, not looking to your own interests, but each of you to the interest of others. And as I read that and I think through, how does that apply in our given situation where we find ourselves today? One thing that immediately comes to my mind is um, the opportunity that we have to really care for others by uh, wearing a mask. And so uh, as we have experienced, like I said, a, a rise in cases in our area, I would really like to ask every person when, when we come together and we're in the common areas uh, of our building, whether it's in the lobby or the hallways, bathrooms, that kind of thing, if you would, um, to wear a mask. Uh, I have mine here. I'm planning on joining in and being a part of that. Uh, you know, once you get in and have a seat uh, in the auditorium, you feel free to, to take it off and uh, that kind of thing. But anytime that we're in a place where we are interacting and, and moving around with other people, and I know people say, well, you know, I, I don't want to wear a mask. The mask isn't for you. The mask really is for everybody else. It's to uh, keep you from being able to expose others to anything that, uh, any infection that you may have. And so uh, it really is an opportunity for us to walk out Philippians chapter 2 uh, in loving one another and considering others more important than ourselves. And so I uh, just wanted to ask you starting this Sunday, if you would, uh, to bring a mask. If you say, well, I don't even own a mask. We have some available here in the Welcome Center that we would love to be able to, uh, to offer to you. And so we're asking everybody to do that. And I so appreciate in advance your cooperation with that and look forward to continuing to enjoy uh, fellowshipping together and worshiping Jesus together. So God bless you. Thanks for watching and we'll talk to you real soon. See ya.